At Hart Butte High School, speaking the Blackfeet language has become a priority to students. MTN's Caitlin Boisel has more. Walking down the halls of Hart Butte High School, students and teachers are speaking to each other in their native tongue. For Hart Butte language teacher, he believes the language connects students to their culture. Blackfeet are just absolutely the smartest people on earth. And I think it comes with hand in hand the culture and the language being able to intertwine with each other. But he doesn't just want the learning to be in the classroom, but right in the community. My previous class and this class to be able to work together and go out not only here, but into the Hart Butte community and start labeling everything. For Hart Butte student, he sees how learning the language benefits his life. Uh, I think it's important because, um, you know, it helps me get like better, like connect more with my culture, helps me like with elders more. More elders were losing, but most of them speak Blackfeet. And like, I know a lot of people up in Canada that speak Blackfeet to me. Mm -hmm. And if I learn my culture and learn my language, I'll be able to communicate with them more whenever they ask me to do something. And like, it'll just help me out, like help me out with my tribe and everything. I sat down with Superintendent Mike Tatsy to talk why now they are stressing the importance of the language. I haven't always stressed the importance of it because um, over the years we've had mostly non-tribal member um, administrators. Um, we have had some tribal member administrators that I'm sure they, they thought it was important too, but it's kind of hit and miss. Um, so we've tried to really come on strong with it um, to get our kids to, to understand that it's important. Reporting in Heartview. <laughs> Hello, my name is Boy. I am from Hart Butte. Caitlin Boy Cell. If we lose our language, we pretty much have lost everything. MTN News. For more information on the Blackfeet language, check out our website at krtv.com.